What is going on here? Yeah, nothing. What is going on? Brady! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing on the bed? Whoa, whoa, back up. Back up. <laughs> There's nowhere for me to go. What are you doing on here? You are too... What? There's no room! <laughs> You're ridiculous. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. So at some point these little lawn chairs had tipped over. And you can see where something dug up under there. Matt! Just come look. It could be like a rabid animal. Don't! It's gonna come right towards me! It looks like it's gone. Like, it looks like it's gone. Yeah, it just burrowed under there. Oh, yeah. okay. Something here to stay okay. for the night. That's crazy Maybe though. Someone's spinal column right here. And then took off. Oh, I remember that. What the yeah. heck? That is a part of a spine. We found that a while ago. Weird stuff happens here at night. <laughs> Oh, she evolved. <laughs> okay, so we had an interesting question that I thought we could answer today. Somebody asked why we don't wear wedding rings. Oh, yeah. It's a funny, so funny story, Matt and I aren't actually married. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so I completely, like, made up a full day or week, really. I don't wear my wedding ring because it's so beautiful and expensive. <laughs> and. <laughs> All we do is climb and lift. I can't wear it while I'm lifting because it'll get crushed and scratched. And then I can't wear it while I'm climbing because if my finger gets caught in a hold, it'll pull my finger off. Um, sort of. It, <laughs> there's a chance. There's yeah. a chance, which That's, I don't want to take that chance. Don't wear mine. <laughs> and it just kind of, other than that, I don't really do much. Whenever we dress up and we go like on family occasion, I was gonna say on family occasions. I'm family very, outings. I'm very awkward today. Um, very I'll, awkward. I'll put on my ring and I ask if we're married today. I'm like, are we married today? And he's like, yep. Well, why do you not wear your ring? Cause you don't lift as much as I do. Well, it started out that way. So I, it's sort of habit, I guess, after a certain point. He's just, he just clicking on my muscles. I'm trying to change clicking. the lighting. I mean, yeah, they look good. It's more so just habit now. Like it was a lot of climbing, a lot of stuff like that, and that's actually initially why I got the Coelho mm -hmm. ring, and I have that one, the rubber one. But then uh, that one kind of loose and kind of bulky on my finger, I guess. Like it's. <laughs> I mean, I'll I'll wear it. I, don't, I just keep forgetting. Yeah. So I mean, that's kind of what we both do. We just like. We're still married, regardless. We just don't. Yeah. We We're just still with each other forget. all the time. But my main reason is I don't want to lose my ring, and I don't want anything to happen to it. Moral of the story: We are married. <laughs> um, we're just too lazy and forgetful to wear our rings a lot of the time. Well, that and I. I don't know. Maybe I should get one of those rubber ones. I don't know why I haven't yet. Don't mind for a little bit. Wear it. So I need to get one of those. Yeah. Everybody knows we're married, so it's not like a, I don't know. The wedding ring thing isn't really a big deal to me, aside from the fact that I love mine. <laughs> I'm just not much of a jewelry person. Yeah, me either. Yeah. I never was. The ring in the first place was kind of weird, but I still wore it. Why'd you buy me an expensive one? I like that kind of stuff. <laughs> you all but picked it out, really. I did pick it out. I did. That's a funny start, too, for another time. Okay. What are you doing to them? Nothing. I'm not doing anything. No, no. I'm not ready. Oh my gosh. Oh! <laughs> oh. Nobody's here. Nobody's here. I, go away. I don't eat Girl Scout cookies. Hey. Oh my god. Oh my oh god. god. Ready? Sit. <laughs> Sit. Now are you gonna do the same thing? <laughs> Why they're freaking out because I put their food in their bowls and they heard me while they were out there and then they started whining to come back in. You making a little teepee? I'm glad, I, glad you brought them. Oh yeah. 
looks like a toy that they chewed up. Is it a mushroom? It's a mushroom. <gasps> and I was thinking, man, is that something that Poisonous? Buzz? Yeah. Whoa. But it's interesting. Get rid of it. Yeah. Harmful. Look at that thing. What? It looks like a lotus yeah. flower. What? I shouldn't have ripped that off. That would have been, that would look cool. That's crazy looking. Yeah. Maybe it came up like a bulb and goes. And just popped open? Yeah. Yeah. That's looks crazy. Like, that. like a weird. It's aliens. It's aliens. Aliens. Oh, wait. There's another one. In the world. Get that one. That one's pretty. Yeah, that one looks cool. Look at that. Are there I'm more? Eat it. No. I can Google it first. Oh, look. Armadillo. No, dogs. That's a buzz. <laughs> Hello! You're so cute. Oh, there's the other one. Oh, calm down. All right, so a little, little fun fact. Um, we're about to decorate for Christmas, so if you're triggered by early Christmas decorations, please stop watching. <laughs> Trigger. <laughs> Trigger alert. Yeah. Trigger alert. But, I know, this is spooky. Matt was in the attic at his parents' house. We don't ruin the story. So yeah, I was next door uh, messing with the uh, the attic a little bit. Um, and so, kind of give you a little backstory on the attic. So things get inside of there. And like, we had ringtail, uh, not lemurs, but you know, we just call them ringtails. And then, uh, sometimes we'll have like raccoons and things in there. But some, who knows what else is in there. Tell them about the footsteps. And one year we heard footsteps. And uh, I mean, it sounded pretty big. Like, and they were spaced apart, like someone was up there, and we went like up there Like somebody to look. his size. Yeah, we went up there to look, and no one was there. That was so scary. Yeah. Okay. So, ah, ah, sit, sit. Thanks for listening. Like, I kept hearing things moving in, in the attic, but it was more so scraping, so, which that tells me that it's over the roof, not under. I was like, okay, we're good, and so I, I had to fix this, uh, like, little string to be able to even open it. Uh, and that's mainly because the uh, the last thing that was up in there pulled the string back up. That's right. <laughs> into the attic. And so I had to go up there and fix that. And I was like looking around trying to see if I can even see anything while standing on a chair. Well, finally I got all that worked out. Started walking up the ladder. Uh, got into the attic. Was rock walking around a little bit with my little flashlight. Um, and it's a little battery powered flashlight. And this thing decides to just shut off right in the middle of me being up there with all the sounds and stuff. And so then I'm having, having to like... Keep a cool mind, turn around, <laughs> work back Slowly towards the light. Slowly back out. <laughs> yeah. And it's like you can't step in between the beams. It's one of those type of attics. So it's like not a, uh, there's no plywood or anything like laying on the floor that you can walk on. It's just beams and you have to hit it. And of course with my bad leg <laughs> and then one leg or one arm holding a, a flashlight. It was, it was a, little, a little rough. I'm surprised I didn't hear, Blair. Yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't have heard anything. You would have been like, okay, just going to make breakfast for two hours. <laughs> Start watching YouTube yeah. conspiracy videos. <laughs> Back anytime soon. He probably just got sidetracked with the piano or something. <laughs> Thanks, Blair. Alright, so this is the... Oh, I hate addicts. Creepy. Alright, go up there. <laughs> Brady, what'd you get into? Oh, yes. did you know? What were you doing, Brady? You chicken pox or something. Give me throwing the pumpkin. No, what? The, so the deer can eat it. Wait till it's like actually it's still fall. It. It's still fall. But it, no, I don't want it to fall. Fine. Leave it, and plus it's just gonna be like an eyesore for a little while. Brady's never seen Frosty. So he'll say hello. <laughs> One thing that I haven't thought about is all of the decorations and our electricity. <laughs> We're gonna blow our little breaker fast. We can always run an extra extension cord. 
All right, guys, we've got our uh, Christmas decorations. We're gonna get started. I'm gonna show you guys the finished product because I'm so excited. Let's go. So awkward. It's so bad. <laughs> It's your turn. No! <laughs> We're gonna film our finance video. Alright, did you do you like our decorations? Yeah. Oh wait, let me turn this one off. Back, back, back. Stay. So that's our lights, and then, stay, our cute little wreath right here, Frosty, of course, what's up dude, we've had him for three, four years now, I got him at Dollar General for ten bucks, got a wreath up here, he's working on our tree, we've had this forever. Ta-da! That's gonna stay there? I don't know. I feel like that's gonna blow away. Blow away. away. <laughs> Alright, heading inside. We've got another tree right here with our little glittery bell. <laughs> and I got these at Target. These are just a little like metal string lights, which you can bend these and they can they form pretty much to whatever you want. I've got those, it's battery operated. I've got it taped up here. We've got our festive oven mitt, and then I traded out our mugs. Christmas mugs. This is our countdown to Christmas, but it's too early, so we have to wait until 39 days away. Enter with a happy heart. This little tree plugs into a USB port and the lights flash. Chargers. Nice little place settings. Those are all of my festive Christmas attire. Christmas tank tops. I've got my skirt. Tons of socks and a couple sweaters. There's our Christmas buzz buzz. And tell this little guy, little snowman nightlight, cute. Bill, that, Christmas everywhere. Oh yeah, the boys are excited. Oh my gosh, Buzz, I didn't, just back up. Oh, and then our little shakers. Are you ready for Christmas? <laughs> we'll probably add some more decorations as we go. That's what I'm thinking. Um, as we find more. Still have another box to go through of Christmas stuff, but yeah, not not too bad. Does anybody else decorate this early? If any of you guys decorate as early as we do, let us know in the comments. But that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Do you show our Christmas toilet? <laughs> Christmas bathroom. Alright. Well, I hope y'all have fun out there. Bye.